96. Hey, it's Showbiz Shelley, and I am here with one of the stars of the Jingle Bash, Mr. <laughs> David Archuleta. Hey. Hey. <laughs> so, first of all, your album did super well. Last time you were in studio, we talked about it. You were like, oh, I hope it does well. And it did oh. number two. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How- it was really exciting. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't, I definitely wasn't expecting that, but it's just great to you know see how things are turning out and it's been fun doing all these shows it's been crazy and especially with the snow here it's <gasps> been insane it took us uh, over an hour to get here with all the cars just going Bruh. Just a <laughs> little bit at a time, right? But yeah, we got here yeah. safely. That's what well, matters. Well, we're really glad you did. And you have a ton of young girls out there that are really uh, glad you did, too. <laughs> Can I ask you, we have been like doing some broadcasts like, outside of the studio, talking to people who are fans of yours. Your fans are so passionate. Why do you think uh, that is? Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I, I really don't know. But, you know, it's cool. It's cool to see that. You know, you have support from your fans and that they're coming out and um, just showing your the, showing the love. They yeah. have, like, shirts for you. They've made, like, pins <laughs> and stuff. It's crazy stuff, right? Uh, it's funny. It's funny to see. <laughs> so, I bet. It must be yeah. crazy for you. But it's exciting, like you said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, did you catch that? That was good. <laughs> <I know. laughs> well, here, yeah. I'll ask you to sing in a second here. But, uh, you know, I wanted to ask you, they've been talking about a lot of uh, changes that are going to be happening to American Idol, like not focusing as much on the bad singers. There was even a rumor or Paula might be leaving. I mean, have you heard about these? And what do you think? I haven't, I haven't really heard any of the rumors. No? The only thing I've heard is about um, the fourth judge, Cara Diaguardi. Mm-hmm. And she's awesome. I'm so excited to see what kind of input she's going to put into the whole thing because she's so talented and has so much experience. Mm-hmm. And I think she'll bring a really cool element to the judge panel. And um, I mean, she's an amazing writer, amazing singer. And it's just talented and i think she'll have a really she'll just be really smart i think so cool really good opinion so watch what she says she'll probably have some good stuff to say Listen but who knows David, you never yeah. know yeah you never know what'll happen but hey from what i've seen so far she's been great cool and she's really spunky well that's good for idol that'll be good right yeah. new little twist on things and uh obviously it's christmas time the christmas season what's your best christmas memory anything that sticks out to you christmas memory well one one really cool memory was just last year we had a family reunion mm-hmm. and it was just nice it was my mom's whole side of the family and we just partied and had a good time yeah and your birthday comes like what three days after christmas yeah three days so let me ask do you get separate gifts or are they join or do you get gift um, or what happens you know i don't i don't really get a whole lot of presents or anything because i never ask for anything really it's just like uh, whatever you're so humble a few years ago i asked for a phone that was for my 15th birthday and you got a cell phone i got a phone oh good but i don't I feel like when I ask for something and then get it, it's uh-huh. just like, oh, I got it. No, I want this. You know, it's like <laughs> once you have it, then it's just kind of like, I don't know. Anything that you want specifically this year or you just, you don't know? There isn't, to be no? honest. Not that I can think of right now that I need and really want. Tell me a little bit. Now you have a new single that'll be coming out, right? Yeah, there'll yeah. be a new single coming out. That's really exciting. And it's one I helped write, actually. So that's exciting. It's called A Little Too Not Over You. And it's one I wrote with Robbie Neville and Matthew Gerard. Matthew Gerard's written Breakaway for Kelly, and uh, Robbie wrote One Step at a Time for Jordan. Oh. And it was in a bunch of other songs. Robbie actually had a hit in the 80s called C'est La Vie. Isn't You're funny? so musically knowledgeable. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, people no from idea. the 80s know that. Oh, right? well, I don't when know. were you born? You were born when? I was born in 1990. <laughs> <laughs> So, so what's your excuse? Huh? I just, it was actually on a commercial. Yeah. There was a CD that was like a few years ago and it played all these 80 songs and it had Human League and Pretty Poison and um, Robbie Neville. And it, that was one of the songs that it played. Well, maybe for Christmas, your new single will be number one. That'd be a nice gift, right? <laughs> yeah, no? that, that'd be cool. But I mean, you know, it's not like... Oh, I need a, a number one song. It, well, you don't uh, seem like that's how, like, oh, I need, like, it. maybe just a cell phone when it comes to a cell phone, but besides that, no. Well, cell phone's important now. Yeah, it is. It's it really just is. like, you know, everyone's using a cell phone. Uh. I mean, it's crazy. I mean, even, like, little tiny kids are getting cell phones now. It's yeah. really funny to see older people, though, with, with cell phones? phones, and they don't know how to use it. It's funny. <laughs> 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 but it's it's cool. And, you know. uh... You know, if you don't mind my asking, now you obviously you have your new song out. Who yeah. you sing about crushes and being in love? Who are these girls you're talking about? You know, I don't, I don't really talk about like super deep love. Oh. You know, not, I don't, <laughs> not like that kind of stuff. It's more, uh-huh. I don't know. It's just, I don't. You kind of 
keep those kind of, I don't know. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. I'm embarrassed. Okay. Do you oh, have a girlfriend? No, okay. I've actually never had a girlfriend. No, you haven't? Nope, not yet. Well, you know what? Just take a look in the crowd tonight. And I'm sure you'll find plenty of candidates. <laughs> well, you know what I mean? I, that's, <laughs> I don't know. That's not the right, that's not the way I want to find a girlfriend. You know, you have to get to know them yeah. and see if you're compatible. And I think, I think it's really important to get to know mm -hmm. the girl because it's just like, you're hot come backstage you know no yeah no not good you uh, don't strike me as that way. type yeah you know i'm gonna tell you something jesse too. mccartney says sometimes he does that that yeah but you know what do what you do man you'll be fine you'll, you'll find a girlfriend okay yeah? <laughs> have you had your first uh, kiss yet no, no. Oh, oh, you, know, you have to wait for the right person right person right yeah and okay last but not least david last time you were in studio you talked very much how your your lips get chapped a lot right yeah you yeah, I, yeah, but I actually have chapstick with me right now. You know what? I have a little gift for you, cameraman and uh, Jay Nice. Mr. Jay Nice is back there. Do you want to help oh. me present this to you? <laughs> we have <laughs> Oh, this is the new thanks. stuff, man. It's new. We've, the we're new converting stuff. Converting you. Let me upgrade. Really? You. Uh, let me <laughs> upgrade you. Carmax. Cool. And you know what? I put oh, awesome. a couple chapsticks <laughs> in here, so you oh, never cool. go without your chapstick. Oh, what kind of chapstick? Well, why don't you take a look? You said that your favorite was take Bath and Body look. Works. Well, that was a really good one. I have, strawberry that's, Carmax. That's strawberry, good stuff. cool. Yeah, it's awesome. good. Awesome. So it tastes like strawberry. Yes, it does. Yeah, Ooh. it's a little hard to open. It you know what? Well, it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's see. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. See, pretty I knew we'd like it. Yeah, we're buds now. That's funny. I like penguins. So. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, I'm glad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. Oh, yeah. This like... is the one I had that I don't know where it went. You're cool. kidding, really? Yeah, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you. Wow, Aww. you gave them a good variety here. That's cool. I told you I was, you know, I was thinking about you after you well, said thanks. your lips. I want your yeah. lips to be chapped, especially here in Chicago, <laughs> man. Yeah, it's pretty cold here. And for that first kiss, that'll come in really handy, too. <laughs> How was your first kiss experience? David Archuleta turning the table. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going to go into that, actually, because oh, it's really on, embarrassing. you're asking me all these questions. David, I'm the interviewer here, David. <laughs> David I thought we were just talking and David, until you out. wear a Santa outfit like this, you can't talk to me, okay? okay? Well, if you get me one, I'll wear it. Oh, would you I'll really? come back next year and wear it, just for you. Hey, I'm going to hold you to that. Okay. I will. All right. Yeah, okay. I'm up for it. Okay. I hope so. Okay. Okay. All right. But you need to answer the question. I told you it's really awkward. You don't want to hear about uh, it. It's really weird. Okay. All right. I guess that happens a lot. That was first, so easy. First kiss. Okay. <laughs> Slid right by oh, that yeah. one. Oh, man. Right. Well, this has been fun. David. Oh, and, uh, you know, I just want to say, by the way, you better be careful out there because I was just talking to a couple girls that are really, really big fans of yours. So. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Uh, well, I hope they have a so, fun time. Yeah. Hope everyone who came out tonight has an awesome time. It's going to be a great show. Some really cool acts. Jesse McCartney, Rihanna. Exciting stuff. You can take so, my yeah. job. No. <laughs> you would do the interviews, David. Oh, boy. Very nice. Cool. Well, thank you so much, Davey. We All love right, you yeah. here. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Good to talk to you. B96.